see, I don't think I know enough about you. Yet. I want to learn who you are. Get inside of your head. So here's your job. There are two philosophers who have interesting theories about morality and ethics. They're the two guys you're looking at now, Immanuel Kant and Jeremy Bentham. They each came up with their own idea of what a good action is. Kant proposed the idea of the ontological ethics. By his model, all actions are inherently good or bad, regardless of their consequences. Now let's use the trolley dilemma as an example. A trolley is going to run over five people who are tied to the tracks. If you change the direction of the trolley, it would only hit one person. Kant would argue that you don't change the trolley's direction. Sure, five people will die, but you didn't have any direct input on it. If you change the trolley's direction, that one death was caused by you. You committed an immoral action regardless of the outcome. Jeremy Bentham, on the other hand, would disagree. Bentham proposed the idea of utilitarianism. By his ideology, the right or moral decision is the one that results in the most good. The outcome is more important than the action itself. He would say that you steer the trolley to hit the one man. Sure, you were directly involved in his death, but more people survive than would have otherwise. All you need to do is tell me who you agree with. Kant's deontological method or Bentham's method of utilitarianism. Where do your morals lie? Personally, I'm just curious who tied everyone to the tracks. There are much more efficient ways to kill people if that was your goal. Anyways, push the button in front of the portrait of who you agree with most. After that, head out into the hallway. Your next trial will be waiting for you.